Hey coach, so excited you found us. A couple of things. First of all, go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better. Let me help you. 30 plus years of coaching. I've done it. I can help you. Um, go over and check it out. 14 day free trial videos, everything you would want to become a better basketball coach, less than a dollar a day. Go over and check it out. Also go over and subscribe and like. That would really mean a lot to us. We're trying to get to 100,000. Let me help you put some banners on and some championship rings on your hand. Go over and check it out. Let's head off to the video. You two big men. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. All right. We're going to demonstrate our zones right now. I want, it, I want to tie this in to what we're trying to show with our zone defenses. All right. The first zone that we used, I used this in high school and we used it in college, was the 1-3-1. One, one. Now, I'm not exactly sure how we would use you guys, but I, I'm going to put you in what I think is a position. I'm going to start you out on the point. You're going to be on the point defensively. All right? I'm going to have you play this wing. You're going to go to the baseline. No, we're not having a big man on the baseline. Um, we felt that the 1-3-1, one, one, if played correctly, would slow the ball down from one side of the floor to the other. That it would be very strong down the middle. A point guard who met the ball at midcourt, who was able to force the ball off of the middle, to one side or the other. So, I probably, now I'll just use you as a, a passer and a demonstrator. I'll use you two guys as well. If, if the defense right now would all go blue, and let's bring you guys in as whites. And then one of the ladies come out in offense too. Yeah, white. You know, one reason we did play some zone is it took away the screen and roll. The pick and roll has become a huge part. And zones by nature, you are covering an area and you take away that kind of screening action. It's hard enough to do it, but in a zone, you are there. At least you should be. Now, in the 1-3-1, one, one, we have five offensive players. One, two, three. Did he get, is he bloody? All right, I'll, I'll cover for a while here. Now, it's really important that you play big in this zone. I mean, if you have a choice between playing down here like this and playing up here, play up here. Have the hands. Tie up the court. Make it. J just get your hands up right now. I mean, everybody in a stance. Get your hands up. Got to look like you're alive back there. I can't see passing angles nearly as well. Now let's this get two way. more guys out. Now here. drop your hands. I want. Now I can a three see a, against three now I can, situation. I can get the ball where and I let's want. get the three so defenders one, with white shirts, stance, but three offensive with players hand. with blue shirts. Point so guard, let's get a guard and a big man and a get swing the ball player. Out of the middle. A guard, a big man so and a swing player. Come on out here. If I'm and bringing Travis, the ball down like this, would you come on you out? Take I'm going to use you, where you try as to steer me to this side. A helper in this now drill. wing, your free get throw line extended, high hands. We don't want to let him go. I into just this want gap. to show you're going to punch it, but the, you're also there. Of the build-up we've got a we big man right there at that elbow because area. I think it will translate right. in the what now, we were if trying I take to do to this side, in the zone defenses that we want to demonstrate one, three, later. One. This is probably the right, only this is the three on three situation that was totally down, different from the way drill. we would do it in a man-to-man. Right, you matched up. I'm You're going to play a little player cat over there. Game with me. Offensive player big out here. You've got the middle third of the floor there. Don't let Travis me throw. You'll be easy right in the pass middle of the lane to that side. That's right. Bother it. Kick ball. your legs up. Force, son. Would you go out there? Here is the ball. Force a non-penetrating right, pass. Right from the get-go. Force if this is where the ball is. Show me where you'd be because positioned. Because now that gives everybody right, more that time. Gap, you can still to adjust to the, the ball. You can see the man. The one you're thing support. you're going to hear you're in, your, in most your flat zone triangle, defenses, and especially this one, is air time. If that's who you're guarding, I got the ball here. Air time. If I gave the ball to him, and we're talking about the ball in the end line, you're in your gap. If you your ball pressure and let this. But what we're going to do? If you let me throw, because this is one of these quick passes. The ball's not in the air very long. Quickly and instinctively, and it's hard for everybody else to catch up. Can you choke down on the ball if it gets in the paint? Yes. I'm going to throw the ball yeah, you at won't times be out there because then I'll just throw to behind. A player I'm going to get perimeter. to you guys in a second. 
And then if, but you, if you force me to throw one of these, throw it back to me. That ball's in the air a lot longer. Live. It then gives I want you to go live else three time on three. to adjust. But what I'm also going to so, do, stretch that's out That's number one. Is I'm going to throw the ball into center, the paint and then seal now, the ball to one be side the, of the, the reaction. Other. We could call uh, traps this, in this. We could have you trap so with the wing Coach, where you can score, show but any of that right now. Unless they are late the other thing there, I'd like you to, you just to know right to away flare is, the ball off um, to one of these guys. Travis, you guys to the have high got post. to get down if and the ball goes down to the high post. And I don't mean that he's a great shooter like this. So you can't just say you won't be able to close position if he flares it. We don't want you to dig down. If he's lazy, dig at it. He's got to go you're through Bemidji from that weak side. right now. I mean, it's there. just like but we flies also want on you the know point what, guard in the one three ball. one going after to it. trap the high post. Now, coach, you're just going to turn it, and you're going to be he's in. He's taking fact, a lot of hard time, pressure. This, this and offensive player the ball back is more worried you close about the ball. You close the ball here, and you'll get us. You close your gap. You are trapping the ball until they get the ball. We're going to throw the ball three times to the coach. And then he's going to flare it out. Let's wings. I'll probably go live after that third Balls time. Balls out front. Again. But I want to see how quickly we dig. Like we said, if how you bring it with close. Uh, with high get an hand. offensive. Where is he back? Here we go. Come on out. Here's the ball. Thank you. Dig, You're going to be a point on offense. Post. You got him off center. Wings. Dig. We want you to be Nothing easy. high hand. Close. Right here. Good. Good cover. And if they make that pass to the wing, you're right there to close out. You're right there to get to the shoot. Dig down. We don't want you to be overextended Big to start with. We want live. you to be in a position live. where you can get to that lane. Now, now, once it's live, and then, then if you think three. he's trying to make a quick pass baseline, you get that outside. All right, hand out. create any turtle. way you can to slow the ball once down. Once we yell from live, wing coach baseline, steps off. From he's here no longer across the court. He's no longer what do we part want to of create? It? He's just a Air facilitator. Time. And I'm telling you, you've got to dig down now, hard. Now, here's the key Some for the other wings. And I saw Once before we got this, you wanted to make a steal elbow. elbow. I don't want you, you know to know what would that? happen? To you Travis make one right steal now, a game and but you'd, you'd be giving up be back door lobs down and dunks. dunks the and then you've the got to be just as active Balls away from you. Out. Now, I liked one thing I saw. You will the pass was made and create over here, that try and you were already helping on the weak side. You came and covered for and him. one of the keys until he got back to his man and he bumped you back. Away from the ball. There are times where you have to scramble. When you have to spot. help your teammates so they open by up scrambling the just to cover the ball, stop the ball, and not be they, so the old worried about the guy The old term was you kind of stand guarding. there and it's a coat That's important in man coat man hanger zone where you just you move two defense. steps this way, two steps this go, way, yeah. the way a coat hanger swings on a rod. I threw it. That's not what we want. This is where the man-to-man -man stance comes in. When you sink away from the ball, we want you to be close, close stance. Your rear end to the baseline. Inside good. That's good. Up. If if, if you hands. think now, you've got what do I have? A pretty good gamble like on an inside out steal. Good vision. We'd like exactly. to see that. You've got and vision from the right gap now, position. If they do I throw think you a lazy pass back out here from the inside you're see out. It. And in other words, if I was playing back out in here, soon. and I I just if you're in this making a lazy stance, pass, I get the steal get back there again from the gap out instead. And of you're in this kind of stance, and over that gambling man starts like this, starts now to cut baseline. You're gonna see. We it just don't want to give up not easy give up back block. doors or easy if penetration. If you're in this kind of we stance, we want to build that shell. Step out a we want to build that Thank wall you. around the lane. If you open it up like this, come and set a back screen on. Just. Now you run to the lock. They throw it, you turn, and you're picked off. But if you're in that help side stance right, that we're if talking If you can about, get there quick enough to get a hand now, out, that's even better. That I'm shows good hustle. Now, now, if you I didn't get it, I would hope I you'd have enough it. balance to get, get your the hands up. And if you flare it, can't you get close out to your man. Whether it's man that's to man good. or zone, I want you to be vision to steal quick flexions. You don't have to be physically any quicker than you are right now. But if you have vision away from the ball, if you see what's going on on the strong Dig side down. as well as the movement away from the ball, you're going to look a whole lot quicker. Close, because when you have Line. vision, you Line. can anticipate. But when you're blinded, I mean, the other the other weakness, weak side, and I'm not going to go through it with you, but that's the same thing you would do. The ball's on that side, you show me your stance in here. All right, foul. Show me he how just you ran beat. a good yeah, old give and go it. cut. Inside jump out of the ball and try to get that hand the ball. in the passing lane. Because the other right, key one more time here. back there is I kind of like you reactions. worried about guarding now the side. Now I want it to not even be a you, reaction. You play but with a close stance to the ball. Now sure enough, you take away this score, but you give up something here. 
I mean, or defense you're is in a bad position for the weak side rebound. and not reacting. Offense is about remember reading we said the defense, zones, taking your time, and then reading what they're giving you. Glass. Here we go. So I'm going through this quickly. Stats. But wings, be big when the ball's coming to your side. Close out to the shooter. When it's away from you, sink into the paint. Close stance so you see the ball, you see what they're trying to do over here. Live! Live! All right. Man live. in the middle. This is your domain rebound. right here. That's right, good. People are not going to get your job this paint done until the rebound's done. You have to really get taking away those straight that. line drives. Okay? If it goes to the high post, belly up, and what did we tell you to do? It comes in here? Double down. Double down. Get the ball out of here. Make them flare it, and we'll cover. You also, and this is what we're going to get to in a second, you have to work very closely with this baseline player. All right? Hey, Coach, glad you're liking the video. Make sure you like down below. That helps us a ton. Subscribe. Hit the little bell up above. Get a notification when we go live every day. Also, um, make sure you go over and check out teachhoops.com for coaches who want to get better.